Hello my friends, it's Runar again. Sorry for not making any videos lately, but my family has been home and then I can't make videos. As simple as that. Just a quick video today. Umarex HDR68. This is uh, the 16 year version. It has the disc in the bottom there. To make it more reliable, I drilled the disc with a 1mm drill bit. So, uh, let's see how many shots we can get from it and what power we get. I have PVC iron balls here from homedefense24.com. Make sure you check them out. 10 gram silicone spray. And as always, Umarex, CO2 canister, and as we know, tip goes outwards, because of my shitty arthritic finger, <coughs> or fingers, I'm going to tighten up the cap. If you have uh, normal fingers, then uh, you don't have to do this. Let me go more. No, stop there. So, loading is very easy. You just simply drop on the balls into the cylinder. Nice and white balls. Push them in the front of the cylinder. They stay in place. Okay. I have a tin can. Let's see if we can make some holes in it. One moment. As you can see, temperature today is just over 20 degrees Celsius. So, let's see if it holds gas. Whoops, sure does. But the sh shaking mo motion made uh, one ball drop, drop out of the cylinder. Let me put it back in. Like so. I put up the tin can inside the trap there. 10 gram ball. Two nineteen. Ball is still inside, but it made a crack in the rear and a hole there. Twist the can a bit more sideways. Let's see if we can make some more holes in it. Two twenty nine in there and uh, made a dent in the rear there. Here's the wall. Let's see if I can uh, put the shot next to the hole. Even hotter. 2.34. Hole there. And another dent in the back. See if I can make some holes in this side. Two twenty and no hole. 
just a dent. It should be one more. Then we can do a little reload. Two eighteen. Now it made a hole. And crack the rear side there. So let me do a little reload. Let's continue. Two twenty. I shot next to the other one there. And the ball went out the back uh, somewhere. Here it is. Let's see if I can hit the edge there. Starting to drop a little. 212. I hit where I aimed, right here, and the ball went out the back here. It has some nicks from the tin can. Let's see, can we make one more hole in it maybe, on the side there. Dropping more, 208. And I almost cut the can in half. <laughs> Just hanging by this thread here. Let's see if I can uh, cut it. One ninety nine and voila. Tin can cut in half. <laughs> There's the ball. I'm just shooting into my trap there. One ninety. I think I just stopped there. No point in uh, just uh, shooting out the remaining CO2 gas because the velocity will drop like a stone. So yeah, cut the tin can in half. And this is a very sturdy tin can also, not something uh, flimsy. So yeah. 16 year version, drilled with a 1mm drill bit, uh, a hole in the restrictor. Let's empty out the rest of the CO2. Like so. So, yeah. Big thanks to Florian Söller for all the cool uh, stuff he has sent me. So make sure to check out check him out at uh, homedefense24.com. Nice puncture of the CO2 canister. Let me put some uh, silicone spray down there. And also the O-ring. Of all the paintball markers, I think this one is the fa favorite, the HDR 68. Quite decent sights also, although they are not adjustable. So yeah.
Nice hard eating ammo. Okay. That's it for today. Hope you liked the video. Stay tuned for more videos. Thank you for watching.